Good luck. Thanks for helping me out before. Thanks to you, I was able to finish my painting. I just paint for fun in my spare time. My real job is here, working as the curator. Why don't you take a look around? I know there's not much here, but... Wait! You're a digger, aren't you? If you find anything interesting on one of your digs, could you bring it here and show it to me? If it's really good, I could display it here. You will? Great, thanks. What's that you've got there? It looks like a bone or something. Oh well, a lot of the people who come here are into strange things like this. It doesn't look like much, but if you want, I can display it here. I'll call it an ancient digging tool. What do you say? Thank you so much! I bet there are a lot of people who will come to see this. What? Did you really find that underground? If you did, it's an incredible discovery. I wonder what something like this would be doing underground. Oh well, why don't we call it a human dog? It could be someone's idea of a joke, but why don't we put it on display? Thank you so much! I bet there are a lot of people who'll come to see this. Hmm. 
set the catalog spell. They're found only on this island. No one knows what they're used for. Is it okay if I put this on display? Thank you so much! I bet there are a lot of people who'll come to see this. Oh my! Is that a crystal fossil? Do you know what that is? Those are made when a weaver bot's body crystallizes over the centuries. They're considered grade three national treasures. It would mean so much to me if you'd let me display that here. Please. Thank you so much! I bet there are a lot of people who'll come to see this. That's a Reberbot eye. Look at it. It's so beautiful the way the light goes through that translucent red. These are Grade 1 National Treasures. There have been lots of diggers who've disappeared in the dungeons looking for these. That would be the star attraction for any museum. Would it really be alright if I put it on display here? Thank you so much! I bet there are a lot of people who'll come to see this. You're a digger, right? If you find something interesting on one of your digs, bring it here and show me. I'll evaluate it for you, and if it's really nice, I'll put it on display here.
What is this? It reads... Sleeper. The third door. What does this one say? Dreamer? Well, it should be the last one. What's happening to me? This is the first time I've ever been here, but I feel like I've seen this before. Something is telling me there's danger here, that it shouldn't be opened. It's a man? A person? Was it you who awoke me? It is somewhat earlier than I had planned, but no matter. Thank you for awakening me. Hmm. Have we met before? Oh, please forgive me. You are a purifier model, assigned to the direct command of Mother. As I recall, you were designated Mega Man Trigger. Please forgive me. I did not recognize you in your current configuration. You know me? You don't remember? Ah, I see. You have suffered memory loss, yes? Then for what purpose have you awakened me? I assume... That your reason for coming here is to purge the carbons that have overpropagated during the time I was inactive. Carbons? Purge? What are you talking about? According to Urban Military Security Ordinance A10, the number of carbon units is not allowed to increase beyond the pre-specified limit. If this happens, they are to be purged immediately. My observation, if left unattended, the carbons will reproduce indefinitely. Their numbers will grow, polluting the surface world. They can be quite a nuisance. Carbons? Do you mean the people on the island? The carbons fit mass population model B. They are unstable very difficult to control. Perhaps it would be better to simply reinitialize. Reinitialize? Well, I haven't understood much of what you've been saying, but when you say reinitialize, do you mean no? Huh? This is quite surprising. It would be much simpler if I had the assistance of a proficient unit, such as yourself. Once my task is complete, I shall inquire as to the presence of a backup of your memory on Eden. Until then, please remain where you are. Yes, until then. What? It's a... It's a man? A person? Yep. 
Something tells me he's not kidding either. I really think he plans to kill everyone on the island. Diesel, we've got to do something. We've got to stop him. Hmm, that's easier said than done. Besides, do you think we could beat him? Well, um, what about Mega Man? Hmm, I don't like it, but I can't think of anything better, so... Oh, here's a problem. Hey, Trom! How do you stop this thing? Oh, this? Like that! Mega Man, are you all right? Uh, thanks for your help. Come on, hurry up! He's getting away! Right. It's not over between you and me. I won't forgive you if you die or anything stupid like that, so be careful in there, okay? Right. See you later. Don't worry, Tron. If anyone can do it, he can. I know.
Hmm. It appears I miscalculated the odds of your ability to escape that trap. You are, however, too late. Eden was activated as soon as I entered this room. It cannot be deactivated as long as I, the master key of this island, remain here in this control room. All that remains now is to wait for Aiden to enter transmission range and send the command to execute the reinitialization of this island. Once that command is received, the 10,000 workers aboard Aiden will execute it immediately. My estimates indicate their work will be completed in less than five minutes. Now that Eden has been activated, any further interference from you will remain on file, thus tarnishing my operating record. Fortunately, you are suffering from memory loss and fragmentation. Therefore, as Keeper of this island, I hereby exercise my prerogative of correctional dispensation. Prerogative of correctional? What? Allow me to rephrase. I will exercise my authority to terminate your program. Ready? You were nearly successful in terminating my life support subroutine function. But do not be disappointed. It appears it will take longer than anticipated for Eden to reach its optimal altitude. If you can terminate me before then, you will be able to stop it. Assuming you are capable of deactivating me. What?
Are you ready? It appears I was in error assuming that a bureaucratic model such as myself would be able to best you in hand-to-hand -hand combat. However, I was successful in keeping you occupied long enough for Eden to achieve optimal altitude before you could interfere. Bureaucratic Model 3rd Class. Authorization number 8677. Requesting a reinitialization of this island system and a memory backup of its bureaucratic systems. Stop! Stop it! If you wish to shoot me, please do not hesitate. My program has already been backed up in Eden's central core. I eagerly await my next act division. Eden systems ready, awaiting confirmation. Requested backup of bureaucratic model Mega Man Juno complete. Execution of Kakarot's reinitialization program will commence in 100 seconds. What should I do? Interrupt command. Priority command rerouted to purifier first class Mega Man trigger. Under suspension of malfunction, bureaucratic model third class Juno has been deactivated by Mega Man trigger as per ordinance 103. Mega Man trigger hereby requests the indefinite postponement of the previous reinitialization order and the deletion of bureaucratic model Juno's backup data. Trigger hereby assumes all bureaucratic authority for the district and will petition Mother for guidance at a future date. Command reroute acknowledged. Priority given to Purifier First Class's command. Eden resuming standby mode and returning to pre-designated coordinates. Deleting law of Purifier First Class's correspondence as required by security ordinances. Requesting that notification to Mother be carried out by Purifier First Class Present bureaucratic authority trip. Data? There's nothing to worry about anymore, Mega Man. Everything should return to normal shortly. Do you know who I am? I'm your peripheral memory storage device. You originally created me so your memory couldn't be scanned by Mother too. I can't tell you anything yet. But soon I'll be able to tell you everything. What you are, why you lost your memory, your original function, and mission. Mega Man! Mega Man! Blasted contraption! It's always breaking down at the worst time! Mega Man, are you alright? Yep, I'm just fine. Gramps and I were working on the radio forever, but couldn't get it to work. Mega Man, you won't believe what we saw. I'm glad these old eyes of mine lasted long enough to see it. Calm down, Gramps. He's been like this ever since... Huh? Mega Man? Are you alright? Oh, uh, it's nothing. Really, I'm sorry that I scared you. You're always running off like that, making me worry myself sick over you. But somehow, I know you'll always make it back. I have faith in you. Thanks. See you soon. Data, let's go! <coughs> Ready? 
Make a map? Ready. Bro, tell me, do you really have to go so soon? After all you've done for us, please stay a while longer. We haven't had the chance to thank you properly. Well, it's not that we don't want to stay. It's just that we've got some unfinished business that we've got to take care of. Right? Yep, that's right. Besides, now that we've got a refractor for the flutter, it's time for us to go. If you must go... Won't you at least come to town and say goodbye to everyone? Hmm. I suppose we should at least say goodbye, eh? Hey, Mega Man, why don't you go? Give him our best! It would mean so much to everyone. Go on, Mega Man, and say goodbye to the Junkman's wife for me. Okay, I'm going.
thank you so much for your help. Take care of yourself. Boys, take care. Goodbye. See you later, Amelia. We meant to come here in the first place, right? But everything worked out in the end, right? Yeah. Hey, Mega Man, did something happen while you were underground? Huh? Yeah, well, not really. Don't worry about it. Well, I don't know, but... <laughs> don't ever forget that I'll always believe in you, okay? Whoa! Mega Man! Whoa! Look outside! The island! Mega Man! Okay. What is it? Whoa! Whoa, left! Left! Huh? Okay. <laughs> hey, isn't that... The old king is off. Hey, hey! Thank you so much! Thank you! Bye-bye! Hey. at home are watching. Our brave heroes are taking off, heading for new adventures. As you can see, the people of Catwalks have come out to send them off and wish them well. Hey, everybody! They were all really nice people. Maybe we'll come back here and see them again. Yeah. Okay. New course. Here we go.
Well, there they go. Not a care in the world. Hey, Tron, can't this thing go any faster? No, it can't. I had to gather up all the spare parts from everything he blew up to build this. That's right, that's right. We'll just have to rough it until we get to the next island. If we sell what we found, we'll get back what we lost and then some. We'll live like kings. Who would have thought there was such a huge refractor down there? And all we had to do was just wander in and pick it up. I told you we'd have the last laugh. <laughs> That's assuming we make it to the next island without thinking. Oh well, at least he's in a good mood. Bye. <laughs>